Welcome to Travels Unfiltered. Today we are highlighting the top 18 things to do in Paros, Greece. For more travel tips make sure to subscribe to our channel. Starting off at number 18 we recommend checking out the traditional Greek village of Lefkas. Lefkas was originally the capital of Paros and was built at an altitude of 300 meters above sea level on a hill covered with pine and olive trees. Full of traditional whitewashed houses mixed with Venetian architecture, the charm and beauty of Lefkas is still untouched by mass tourism. We suggest doing this as part of a guided tour so you can fully understand and immerse yourself in the town's local history and culture. You can find our favorite walking tour linked in the description box of this video. While touring this village you get to stop at bakeries, try local foods, explore the town's historic and iconic church, and be guided to the highest point of the town offering breathtaking views of the island. Coming in at number 17, we recommend treating yourself to a luxury picnic on one of Paros beautiful beaches. This is a great opportunity to add some extravagance or romance to your vacation. Treat yourself and your loved ones to a luxury picnic package on the beach which includes a beautiful setup, decor, delicious charcuterie boards, drinks and more. You can find our favorite package linked in the description box of this video. Sit back and relax while you enjoy the mesmerizing beach view at your chosen time of day, whether that it be sunrise, sunset, or a lovely sunny afternoon. Coming in at number 16 we suggest visiting the Moretes winery. Paros is one of the most important Greek islands when it comes to winemaking, it is where the Monomvasia grape was kept alive when it died out everywhere else. Established in 1910, the Moretes winery is now in the family's fourth generation. We recommend heading here for a lovely day out and enjoy the plentiful different wines with great scenery. You can even go into the aging cellars underground, see the antique winemaking implements in the museum and taste their full range of reds, whites, rosé and dessert wines with a delicious cheese and meat board. Coming in at number 15 we suggest participating in a food tour. You can't go to Paros and not try the delicious local delicacies. This is the best way to experience and taste your way, though one of the most important parts of Greece's culture, its food. Our favorite tour, which you can find linked in the description box of this video, takes place in either Parikia or Nausa and caters for all types of foodies including vegans, vegetarians, or meat-eaters. A knowledgeable and friendly guide walks you through the streets of the old town, giving you the opportunity to soak up the atmosphere as you're taken to the best local and traditional food joints that you might otherwise miss. It is truly an immersive experience as you try delicious foods made with fresh local ingredients and delve deeper into Greek traditions. Coming in at number 14, we recommend spending a morning horse riding along one of Paros' beautiful beaches. This is an experience you'll likely never forget as you ride along the beautiful scenic trails to beaches, where you'll even get to enter the sea. This is the ultimate way to see the island in a unique and amazing way. You can find our favorite horse riding experience linked in the description box of this video. Coming in at number 13, we recommend taking part in a private photo shoot. Paros is a postcard perfect island with beautiful towns, architecture, and landscapes. Of course, you should be coming home with hundreds of amazing new photos and why not have some of those be professional ones. Skip the awkwardness of asking strangers to take photos of you and instead book a private photo shoot with a professional and have your photos taken on a good quality camera instead of your phone. You can find our favorite professional photography package linked in the description box of this video. We love it as it's super flexible, allowing you to choose a time that suits you while also giving you the opportunity to completely customize your experience according to the kind of shots you want to capture. You will receive all your photos digitally after the photo shoot and will be able to showcase your best shots to social media or your family. Coming in at number 12, we suggest going stargazing with the Astronomical Club of Cyclades. Find yourself floating among the the stars and join this unique stargazing experience. See the beautiful starry sky, the constellations it offers, and more in this one-of-a-kind experience. What better way to do this with the Astronomical Club of Cyclades? You'll get to use their amazing brand new equipment while experiencing some beautiful views of the planets that surround us. To book this unforgettable cosmic experience, head to the link in the description box of this video. Coming in at number 11, we suggest dining at some of the most amazing restaurants Paros 
has to offer. There are a huge number of incredible restaurants and traditional Greek taverns in Paros. For our favorite dining experiences, we recommend checking out our recent video highlighting the best restaurants Paros has to offer. You can find the link in the description box of this video. Coming in at number 10, we recommend participating in a walking tour of Parikia. Parikia is the capital of Paros and we highly recommend exploring the area but what better way to do this than with a knowledgeable guide. Our favorite tour, which you can find linked in the description box of this video, takes you on a lovely walk through Parikia at sunset while informing you about its rich history and culture. The tour also highlights the best places to shop, the best restaurants and taverns, and takes you to the ultimate places to experience the beautiful and breathtaking sunset. Make sure to bring your camera along for this guided tour, because we can guarantee there will be plenty of photo opportunities. Coming in at number 9, we recommend experiencing some of the amazing nightlife and parties that Paros has to offer. Paros has a vivid nightlife, and its party scene is extremely popular with both tourists and locals every summer. There is a great variety of different clubs in Paros including vibrant nightclubs, live music clubs, and beach clubs which organize unforgettable parties. There are two main areas to go for the best nightlife on the island, Parikia and Nausa. To find our favorite bars and nightclubs in Paros, head to the link in the description box of this video. Coming in at number 8, we suggest taking a full day tour of Paros and Anti-Paros learning about the island's history and culture. This full day tour is perfect if you have limited time on the island and want to see as much as possible before you go, or even if you just want to enjoy the highlights of Paros and Anti-Paros without the hassle of having to do everything yourself. Yourself. This group tour takes you to explore the charming towns, sea views, gorgeous beaches and includes a trip to Paros' sister island, Antiparos. Taking you around on an air-conditioned bus, this tour is a great way to see and do a lot in around 8 hours. Coming in at number 7, we suggest spending the day sailing on the crystal blue waters surrounding Paros. Join a small group sailing excursion from Paros to Naxos. This wonderful trip across the Aegean Sea stops at three different stops for swimming and snorkeling, even stopping and checking out a World War II-era wreck. The trip offers a tasty onboard lunch and snacks to dig into with alcoholic drinks included. You may even see dolphins riding alongside the boat. Check the link in the description box to book your exciting trip to learn more about the surrounding islands while you sail. Coming in at number 6 we suggest the Archaeological Museum of Paros. The island has a very interesting history, and the archaeological museum gives you a chance to delve into the past with unmissable exhibits. Unlike the island itself, the museum is small but full of charm. There is a lot of information and displays packed into its two rooms and courtyard. Inside you can find archaic and classical sculptures, as well as pottery and a variety of other finds from the Neolithic to Roman times. This museum holds the magnificent statue of Gorgon Medusa. The well-known mythological creature has been kept in a fantastic state of preservation and dates back to the 6th century BC. BC. Coming in at number 5, we suggest participating in a guided tour of Nausa, the traditional harbour village of Paros. When you picture Greece, you imagine the whitewashed harbour village of unique caved sugar cube buildings. Well, Nausa most definitely displays this. This quaint fishing village, now popular with tourists presents narrow cobbled alleyways and picturesque architecture. In a guided tour you will be able to visit and see the most beautiful locations of the town and get those amazing travel photos you want. Walk past Naos's amazing restaurants, wander through the many shops and grab a delicious ice cream together on this amazing experience. Coming in at number 4 we suggest visiting one of the amazing beaches that Paros has to offer. Splash in the Greece's crystal clear waters and soaking in the sun is the best way to spend a day in Paros. This island is home to countless beautiful beaches. If you're looking for a postcard perfect beach we recommend Kalymphthrys. This is one of the most famous beaches of Paros and is made up of three separate beaches. You can opt to rent sports equipment and visit Paros main windsurfing hubs such as Chrissy Acti Beach or Pounder Beach. The lively Pounder Beach is where the yearly windsurfing world championship is held. Each of the beaches in Paros provide amazing blue waters and a fun day out. Spend your day in the blue waters, on the sunbeds and the beach bar. Coming in at number 3 we suggest the Nausa Venetian Castle. The town of Nausa holds this very historical Venetian fort that spikes visitors' curiosity. Originally constructed in the 15th century by the Venetians, this fortress was used as a watchtower for pirate and enemy attacks and as a front line in times of war. However, today only part of this fort survives a half-submerged watchtower 
tower that is connected to the mainland with a short path. You can get to the fort on foot via a mole from the harbour. The fort's firing positions make for a beautiful viewpoint and great photo spot of Naus's white and blue seafront. Coming in at number 2 we suggest participating in a marble workshop and create your own souvenir. This unique experience allows you to carve the famous Leichnitis marble with manual and electric tools. This marble is what made Paros a historic and memorable destination. Follow the steps of Greek ancient sculptures and immerse yourself into the island's traditional resources and carving techniques. Spend an evening learning while having fun creating your own souvenirs to take home for the family. This is a once-in-a-lifetime experience and your creation will forever be a great reminder of your trip to Paros. Finally, at number one, we recommend the Greek Orthodox Church Panagia Ekatontopiliani. The name Ekatontopiliani means the church with the hundred doors. Located just a few meters from the port of Parikia lies one of the best preserved Paleo-Christian monuments in Greece. This specific church dates to the 4th century and was a three-aisled basilica supposedly constructed by the first emperor of Constantinople, after the offering of his mother, Saint Helen. Reformations were performed through centuries and today, the church is a complex of Paleochristian, Byzantine and post-Byzantine elements. Most definitely an eye-catching sight and architecture you must see. All these attractions have their own unique charm. To find out more about these sites, tours and activities, head to the links in the description box of this video. If you're traveling to Paros, Greece and need more travel advice, like where to stay or where to eat, then make sure you check out our Paros playlist. Link is also in the description box of this video. With this video almost over it's time to ask you, which attractions will you be visiting on your visit to Paros? And make sure to leave your own recommendations for us in the comments below. As always, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more travel tips and videos, and give this video a like if you enjoyed it. See you next time!